Hi, I'm Larry Janeski from Dr. Energy Saver. The homeowner in this house had a gas-fired water heater that let go. It just leaked all over the floor. And we replaced it with a high-efficiency tankless water heater. Let's take a look. We've already replaced the gas-fired water heater that was here. The tank set right here. And fortunately, this homeowner had this ring called a flood ring on the floor around the water heater and has a drain back there. So when it did let go, it didn't flood the whole basement. Tank style water heater is inefficient for a number of reasons. First of all, you only have a finite amount of water that's heated. And if you're using a lot of hot water, if people are taking showers all at the same time, then you're gonna deplete that and you're gonna run out of hot water. With a gas fired water heater, you'll have a draft hood on the top of the water heater where dilution air comes into the combustion gases. And uh, so you're drawing air from inside your home to basically go up the chimney. And that new air needs to be replaced by outside air that leaks into the house. So we're actually causing the air to leak in from the outside of the house by making a little vacuum uh, with our water heater uh, inside the house. So that's not good. Uh, another problem is that the water heaters, uh, old ones, are not insulated very well. So we have standby losses. Here's a, a tank of hot water losing its heat. Heat goes from more to less and it's losing its heat to the basement or the space that you have it in. So we're uh, inefficient that way. Another problem, we have a tank of water that's hot. We have a chamber up the middle where the combustion gases go to heat that water. And when the water is hot, even when the water heater is off, the, water, the heat in the water comes back into that air chamber and causes a draft up the chimney. So effectively, we heated the water, the water heater shut off, and now the heat from the water is continuing to go up the chimney even when the water heater is off. So we're cooling the water right up the chimney. So we have these problems. In addition, we set our water heater to 120 degrees and it's wanting to keep that tank of water heated to 120 degrees at all times, even in when somebody's on vacation, everybody's sleeping, everybody's at work. That burner is running periodically to reheat that water as it cools down and we're using fuel when we don't have to. So enter tankless water heater. And here's this one right here that Dr. Energy Saver installed. And this is a high efficiency uh, gas uh, tankless water heater and we see that there's no tank at all. Why isn't there a tank? Well, because this water heater makes hot water on demand. So when you crack the faucet open, it senses a little flow through there, the burner kicks on, it makes hot water for you as much as you need and then as soon as you shut the hot water off, it stops. The gas valve can open a lot or a little depending on the flow rate through the tankless water heater. So if you just wanna wash out a coffee cup, it'll just make a little uh, hot water with a little flame. If you are, two or three people are taking a shower in the house at one time, the gas valve will open, there'll be a bigger flame um, and it will make more hot water. As much as you need for as long as you need it, you never run out of hot water and it's uh, highly efficient. We can also see that we have PVC intake and PVC exhaust, and these pipes go directly to the outside. Instead of taking air for combustion from inside the basement or inside your home and running it up a chimney, it takes that combustion air from outside. So we don't create any vacuum inside the building that has to be made up by outside air leaking in because we have dedicated uh, combustion air coming in. The way this thing is designed, we've wrung out so much heat out of the combustion gas that we have very little heat going out of the exhaust. We're getting those BTUs into the water, into our house and less outside. Um, but we can run the exhaust gases through a PVC vent because the exhaust gases are cool because we've wrung all the heat out of them. So these are the components of a uh, high efficiency tankless water heater and they're the reasons why you should consider one and you don't have to wait until your water heater uh, leaks all over the place and needs to be replaced. It is worthwhile replacing it before that happens. If you'd like to generate hot water in your house much more efficiently, never have to worry about running out of hot water, have more floor space because you don't have this big tank in your home, call Dr. Energy Saver. We'd love to help you.